Hello Vavers you're watching YouTube channel USA News Alert. Breaking. Bill Barr outsmarts Nancy Pelosi with powerful legal move. Bill Barr is a smart man. No dig at Jeff Sessions or Matt Whitaker. But those men did not have the institutional knowledge or respect from the rank and file to run the dodge in these hyper-partisan times. No, Trump needed someone strong and accomplished to beat back Nancy Pelosi and the Democrats. Barr also brings a brilliant legal mind to the fight and he just checkmated Pelosi with a powerful legal maneuver. This is about the future, not Trump, and Pelosi would be smart to move forward, not look backward. From BPR U.S. Attorney General William Barr dismissed left-wing complaints that he's overzealous in his defense of President Trump amid Congress endless investigations, saying Democrats have repeatedly moved the goalposts. And that's unfair and wrong, and everyone knows it, even though no one admits it. I felt the rules were being changed to hurt Trump, and I thought it was damaging for the presidency over the long haul, Barr told the Wall Street Journal. Barr says he's fighting for the presidency more so than advocating for President Trump per se because the Democrats' non-stop obstruction of a sitting president damages the office itself. As an example, imagine what foreign countries think when they see that one political party constantly undermines the duly elected leader of the United States. That emboldens them to dismiss the authority of the American president and erodes the United States standing on the world stage. Barr underscored that the executive branch needs to be strong and independent, and not subordinate to partisan legislators who want the president to fail. At every grave juncture, the presidency has done what it is supposed to do, which is to provide leadership and direction, Barr said. However, he suggested that in the current divisive political climate, that becomes almost possible to do. A.G. Barr added, if you destroy the presidency and make it an errand boy for Congress, we're going to be a much weaker and more divided nation. Until Barr was appointed Attorney General in February 2019, he was a respected litigator who was widely admired for his integrity. But as soon as he joined the Trump administration, he was immediately attacked as a partisan puppet. That couldn't be farther from the truth. For one, Barr is a Bush acolyte. And as everyone knows, the Bush family hates Donald Trump and even voted against him. Barr was U.S. Attorney General under George W. Bush, so this isn't his first time at the rodeo. Given his past experience as the nation's top lawyer, it's no surprise that he takes Democratic mudslinging in stride. As BizPack Review reported, Barr triggered Deems and their media henchmen when he recently joked about Democrats' toothless contempt motion. This must be a record of an attorney general being proposed for contempt within a hundred days of taking office, Barr laughed, as the audience erupted into giggles.